cicadas are coming, at least for the East Coast. Back in 1996, a large number of baby cicadas burrowed into the ground to live a quiet life out of our sight. But now, as the age, at the age of 17, as the cicadas prepare to procreate and die, they will rise out of the ground in such numbers that scientists are calling the cicada apocalypse. Now, if you've never witnessed a cicada apocalypse, prepare to see huge numbers of winged creatures, one and a half inches long with big red eyes, making that annoying chirp that's become synonymous with the sound of summer. Now, though they look terrifying, the bugs wouldn't hurt a fly, they don't sting or bite or attack, and the exact date can't even be predicted, but as soon as the soil temperature reaches 64 degrees, expect to see these insects everywhere. Yeesh. They're pretty gross looking. I've never, I don't think I've ever lived through a cicada apocalypse, have you? No, I never have either. I, I, We're not on the East Coast. So <laughs> Apparently <sense>. one hit <laughs> Virginia right after I left. But uh, our wonderful producer, Jenny, actually said that the worst part of that is actually the buzzing noise. That they just, the wings just zzzz, yeah. zzzz, uh, Wait, do that again? <laughs> she suggested that people were actually selling special cicada protection umbrellas that were clear and came down all the way to keep them from flying into your face with your, their, their grossness. You need a cicada net when you sleep. Ooh. No, thank you, no, cicadas. Thank you. Exactly.